<clears throat> so like I said, cleaning out the garage today and uh, sweeping all out and everything. And I figure we'll do a quick little update on the SS16. Still without a tranny. Tranny's right there. And the pulley is plays on the shelf over there. Right there next to that piece of pipe. And uh, basically, I could weld it and use it or put a new tranny in it while I'm at it. And I'd like to put a spline rear end in it because that tranny that was in it was kind of loud. And, uh, you know, I changed the fluid on it once like uh, a year and a half ago, but it was still still pretty loud. So I think while I have it apart, the other thing I'm going to do is uh, pull a tank and repaint it again because I didn't use any. This paint that I used obviously was not ethanol resistant. Luckily the primer was. But that's going to give me an opportunity to find a nice match for Sears Yellow so that when I go to repaint it, I know what I want to use. And luckily I got the removable grill piece, which is more or less new old stock that I can remove and use that to match. So, it's sitting here, you know, if I put gas in it, it'd start right up, I'm sure. I haven't run this in probably about the same time as the Honda, probably about like four, four weeks maybe. Um, but I mean, it's just kind of sitting, sitting idle, no pun intended for now. And uh, I mean, I got other things I got to do, like today I got to straighten these links. Those got bent when I was pulling and those are the lower links for the dozer blade which is right here. And then uh, got this 8 inch mold board. Actually yeah I haven't even, you guys haven't seen this yet. Uh, 8 inch mold board and then I got another another uh, white 3 point hitch back there. I swapped a set of tires for them. Everything's complete. The only thing that doesn't work is the coulter wheel from that is seized. So I have it off over there somewhere. But you know, shops, uh, I haven't really been out here that often lately because I've been really busy. Got a new sign, no parking on an authorized vehicle will be towed away at owner's expense. That was pretty cool. I got some some other signs up. I got another craftsman sign it's on, on top of those rims over there. You got to hang up. So I know, I mean it's, it's progressing I suppose, the shop is. Another thing I got to do is get a new hitch plate because this one's been drilled to shit. But I don't know. I, I got work to do. Here's that light bar that I got to do something with. These are all my weights and stuff. This is the uh, I don't know if I ever showed you guys. This is free drop spreader I got or broadcast spreader. Got that for free from Zagre. Spring one, and uh, that works really good actually. And we're gonna be putting some fertilizer down because it's going to be fall before we know it. Let's see if we can see those stripes any better. Yeah, those are with the 199s. So that's that's pretty good in my book. There it is. Probably do a cold start on it cuz uh got to bring it in. And then Will's coming over later and do some mowing. So there's a shop update, an SS16 update. Really sucks seeing this thing sitting here, but I mean, uh, I know that come spring it'll be uh, it'll be a whole new animal. My hope is that it can get I can get it through winter the way it is, and then start working on it. But uh, we'll see. Anyway, I'm gonna go grab a video of the uh, 199 cold starting, and then I should be pretty much excuse me pretty much done for the day video wise. Thanks, guys.